You gotta come over here. Oh no. Oh yes. All right, you guys, it is two days after Christmas and my book came in yesterday. Um, I had one of my kids open it to tell me it was my book because I knew I wanted this to be special and yeah. How do you feel? I feel a lot of emotions. I have dreamed about writing a book for years. It took me well over a year to actually write the book and so now to see the pages and pages and years of work and dedication and dreaming literally be like right in this little envelope uh what are you waiting for because ah, i'm emotional like i have pits <laughs> in my stomach right now i'm excited oh wow oh my gosh hey that looks great oh my gosh it's like so much like bigger than i thought it would be It's beautiful. Pictures are beautiful. Wow. I freaking wrote a book. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Well, here it is. Uh, the Tiny But Mighty Farm. I can't wait to read it. <laughs> <laughs> Be the first book Nathan's ever read. No. <laughs> wow. There she is. I just love that it has lots of pictures. It has lots of pictures. It represents us and our family. And honestly, just like what, speaking to the small scale grower, you know, it's like you can do this if you dream it and you have a good support system. Like, I think that's really just my vision behind this book was that don't be limited by what you have, but be inspired by what you can do with what you have. What's up YouTube family? I wanted to take a second and say thank you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, it seems so surreal that I'm shooting this video right now with my book, The Tiny But Mighty Farm, in my hands. But I know for a fact that I would not be standing here today flipping through the pages of my book and holding it if it wasn't for the support of you guys. You know, this has been a dream of mine for years and to see that dream realized was a real, just life altering moment. Um, you know, I wrote this book when we were transitioning farms, highs and lows of business and family and life, and it was hard. There were times that I doubted myself and I didn't think I was capable. And I even questioned if my story was worth being told. Um, and anytime I'd have those moments of self-doubt creep in or it got hard or I didn't think I could do it, it never failed that you guys would encourage me or inspire me or tell me time and time again how valuable I am. And I I just want to say thank you. That that doesn't that weighs heavy on me, right? Like it doesn't go without being noticed and recognized and appreciated. And you guys showed me that my story is worth telling, and I'm going to tell it till the day I die. And I hope that this book, through these pages, inspires you that you've got a story to tell, and it's worth telling until the day you die. It's worth inspiring people and encouraging people and growing food and building community. And this book is more than just pages printed on paper. It's my heart. It's my family, it's our dream, it's our vision, and it's extension of ourselves to each and every one of you who has supported us through this journey. So thank you all so much.